Oh, uh, yeah. All right, so we just got gun. What we're watching Sailor Moon R, episode six, aka Sailor Moon season two, episode yep. seven. Sorry, episode seven. Are we episode, on episode this is six. This six. is seven. Oh, this was seven. This was seven. I put in my notes here that it was episode six. No. I must be mistaken. Well, 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 you know, we're we're fifty plus episodes into this. Uh, I'm losing so. track. Yes, yeah, so this episode was called this Memoru one. and Yusagi's Babysitting Maid. Yeah, and uh, babies are the next target, and we get the uh, the new uh, Yumas, what are they called, or whatever, uh, the, the new evil cardigan or whatever. Uh, uh, I don't know. Uh, no, the cardigan is like, they're like Yumas. So oh, yeah, yeah. I mean. so that, well, I mean, these evil entities, uh, they're cardigan, uh, they're gonna, the, the babies are the new target because they're weak. And you know the that that just makes them an easy target for energy, and the babies have to, you know impure. They're so suppose, pure yeah. that the energy must be very potent. I think that is the implication there. And uh, so taking babies' energy, and uh, so I guess the next sequence is a bunch of babies getting their energy absorbed. This is correct. Yeah. Yeah, and uh, and uh, that's not not good, especially because the babies are very cute. I don't like that. So taking care of babies is not easy. Is when we find out when Mamoru and Mamoru and uh, his plus Zagi. I didn't. Care of I one. didn't find there to be much sense in this plot. Yeah. So, um, somehow Ma- Mamoru and Usagi end up getting roped into babysitting this kid. I think it was like the the guy that uh, Ami, that Sailor, uh, was it Sailor Mercury? Yeah, that Sailor Mercury is in love with. Yeah, uh, his like baby brother or whatever something like that uh it's needs to be taken care of but he's sick yeah so it um, goes into the hands of yusagi sukino and um mamoru tuxedo and, mask. and mamoru tuxedo mask who they still have this unspoken chemistry that uh his memories be, have yet to return but his memories have yet to return but the the chemistry is there because yusagi feels so strongly about him and uh, and the baby's crying, and you know I I could only think about this. Uh, you know, usually Usagi Usagi's the cry baby. Oh, that's hilarious! Oh, that's a good one. That's really funny. Yeah, that's, no, good. that's what that's what our audience uh, pays the big bucks for. Yeah, yeah, you, I, I had that one written down. And then Usagi <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. is uh, uh, has this motherly instinct too. Uh, I feel like she's, I know she's so. Caring. But Mamoru is much more of a natural caregiver. Uh, yeah, it seemed. And especially when she says, uh, uh, your house, you keep your room so clean, I think that just implies that he's a very uh, responsible person. Young and man. Y- young man, therefore. The kind of, the kind of young man that, that uh, you would want your daughter to be bringing you know, home to mommy. Exactly. Yeah. And to be honest, I would not trust Usagi with the baby. I'd trust Mamoru first. Because he's, oh, he's, sure. he's strong. Any, he's, of, the yeah. Any okay. of the other sailors. Yeah. Any of the other sailors, but not uh, Usagi. There wasn't very much conflict in this episode, you know, yeah. like the the Cardian, especially because uh, he's talking a bit about. A, she's right? a hypochondriac, I realized too. She was like whooping cough, this that. She was like uh, freaking out if the baby. Yeah, I've heard sick. about the whooping cough sometimes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, you know, this is maybe the nineties. Was kind of yeah, the ninety know. May first, nineteen ninety three. This mm-hmm. episode aired. Oh uh, yeah, damn. I, I yeah, I mean, I don't really remember that. I would have been. Oh excuse me. Uh, twenty five. I would have been. Well, eighty four. Uh, in 84, I was born, so I would have only been, like, eight. Yeah, you would have been nine, yeah. Um, but, yeah, the, 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 the so then we, I don't know, the, the, the middle, the middle ep- episode sequence still, still gets, wants, yeah. I, it's uncomfortable. Well, it's you said something funny while we were watching that, and it was, you were like, uh, you know, uh, oh, it's the baby sailors. Yeah, baby, baby sailors. Episode, the baby right? episode. So it's like, I thought that was pretty cute. Yeah, uh, but the, they're not even baby sailors, chibi. though, is the thing. They're chibi and... Uh, they're just tiny, tiny, Remember, weird, uh, just weird, yeah. it doesn't look right. The sailors are supposed to be strong, powerful women, and then there's these little sequences of these, like, little, these little, they just look like, like that's how I get the impression, they just look, yeah, they yeah, look yeah, weird and stump, stump, stubby, stubby, stumpy. yeah, I don't like it. You ever play Chibi Robo, the video game Chibi Robo? Remember Chibi that? Chibi Robo. Nintendo. Yeah, I wonder if they still make these games, is what I'm wondering. Take my Google here. Don't mind me. Okay. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me if I get my hands on a copy of this. Do a let's play, let's hang, Chibi Robo. I would like to do a let's play, let's hang again sometime. I mean, those are lots of fun. Yeah. Uh, are there any Sailor Moon games? Leave uh, in the comments below. Uh, after you like and subscribe, there were never any Sailor leave. Moon games released never? in North America. Oh, okay. There's lots of Sailor Moon games though. Oh yeah. So, so we have, have to. We have to use an emulator. Yeah, an emulator. 
Uh, post in the comments down below a link to an emulator if you have one, or post in the comments down below any sort of flash game or anything uh, just down there, right in the box down below. There. See, this episode was pretty, pretty. It was like it was definitely like they've been exploring different dynamics of sailors. So we had Ami on our own, we had uh, Usagi and Mamoru, and then we had uh, uh, Sailor Jupiter. And Sailor Venus hanging out, and then Sailor Mars kind of off to the side. And Sailor Mars kind of saves the day at the end using tarot cards. Yeah, yeah, because of uh, her like Buddhist hi uh, history, of course, sure, uh, or whatever that was, right? And stuff and uh, saves the day. But there, you know what? There wasn't much to this episode beside all that. I think we really went over the whole episode there. I think um, so. You know, except for of course, like I mean, we're not gonna just sit here and recap an episode two. I mean, we want to give a little bit of in depth, uh, yeah, thought provoking things some, that some, we thought about, uh, some some criticisms, some criticisms analysis. and such. So uh, we're not gonna just sit here and tell you every aspect of the episode, but uh, we went through every um, like plot point in this episode. Not a, not my favorite, the worst one in a long time, uh, especially because the last couple episodes have been very exciting. Very uh, rewarding. Rewarding too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. What do you think? Wrap it up here. Yeah. Thanks for watching. Really appreciate it. Thank you for watching. Thanks for watching.